Hey there everybody, Douglas Weed here again with another unboxing and I encourage you to check out the first video I've put out on this series of unboxing videos on Wolfenstein the board game. So today we're going to be opening up Wolfenstein All-Stars which is a additional stretch goal expansion from the Wolfenstein board game Kickstarter. Now you may remember from my previous video um, that I received the Kickstarter and um, Unfortunately, it showed up damaged. So the box was beat to heck. The way it was shipped was destroyed. I put a comments into the manufacturer and their uh, customer service department sent me brand new boxes to cover the boxes that were damaged. There were a few figures that were damaged, which I'm expecting to find somewhere in here. But right now we're going to take a look at the All-Stars. And unfortunately, this is not a true unboxing since I already unboxed it before when it should have damaged. But the manufacturer sent me all new boxes that are shrink wrapped, so it still technically applies. So we're going to move over everything from the other box and we'll be going through it as an unboxing as I go along. So this is the All Stars. So the All Stars comes with um, all of the additional stretch goals that came out of this game, all of the additional bad guys. Uh, all of the additional heroes that are available. Then these, a lot of these came out of the Wolfenstein uh, New Order and uh, um, Wolfenstein uh, New Colossus material. Uh, they do have some. They do have the characters from Young Blood in here. So as you can see, the boxes are in pretty decent shape. Brand new boxes. And so we're going to take a look at inside of the All-Stars expansion and go from there, which I'll work my way down. So in this particular expansion, there are all the additional figures. So you have the giant mech that came out because of the additional shipping costs. They added a bigger mech to the game. Uh, the initial people that signed up for the Kickstarter uh, got Hans Gross, the original boss from Wolfenstein 3D, the first mission, Escape from Wolfenstein, uh, with his giant machine guns. And so they added that in here. You can always go back and buy him later. I think he's like 10 bucks normally. But they, uh, the Kickstarter allowed you to get him for free. And then they have all the bosses and bad guys in red and all the new heroes in blue. So you've got... Uh, the doctor from the second level of Wolfenstein 3D, the general from the sixth mission of Wolfenstein 3D. So they have the old ID software games in here, and then you have the two main bad guys from Wolfenstein New Order. So we're going to put this tray in here, and we're going to go take a look in here. So it comes with all of the additional bullet tokens, objective tokens, comes with all the extra little trunks, uh, all of the explosive barrels. So it comes with all of these additional pieces that came out of the Kickstarter. So that way they can expand your game um, even more. Again, here's another bag. So there's more objective pieces. Uh, there are um, uh, different cameras in here. There are multiple different pieces in here so there's a lot of stuff there's there's silent tokens so and then we have the cards which I've opened up the cards originally just to take a look at some of them so you have the room cards but there's still another deck here I'm going to open up for you guys so you have all the different room cards and the boss cards so they tell you how all the rooms work so multiple rooms so you can actually have a random element to this game so rooms set up differently and it sets up where everything is and then you have all of the boss cards. So you have the crypt bosses. Uh, you have uh, the random boss. Thank you, BJ. But Adolf is in another castle, kind of like the Super Mario um, uh, World games to it. So then you have officers' meetings, laboratories, general offices, the Fuhrer regular day, uh, in Adolf's bedroom. So you have all these different objectives that you can do. And then you have the other room cards, which we'll take a look at those right now. So the other room cards 
Again, they have the same room card backing to them. And then you have corridor cards. So you've got different corridors to set up. So all the different hallways. You have um, special rooms. So like the armory, the space marine barracks, the, those regular soldier barracks. So there's a lot of different um, options in this. So next, then we've got the actual character cards, which you have the special Hans Gross card and his dual chain guns. So he has this special card again because of the Kickstarter. Now you can get them separately, like I said, but he's about 10 bucks. Then now you have all of the additional cards that came with the stretch goals for the Kickstarter. So let's see what we got in here. you got Dr. Schaubs, again, the second boss of Wolfenstein 3D. General Fessergut, the sixth boss of Wolfenstein 3D. Irene Engel, the Watcherbot, and William Strauss. So those are the three that came out of Wolfenstein New Order. And then you have more event cards. Coffee time. Uh, you have libraries, moats, pantries. Secret Stairways, Wolfstone 3D, so you can play the weird version of Wolfenstein in uh, the original, um, or should I say the, up, the new version of Wolfenstein New Order. And then you've got blank start spaces, so they tell you how everything's set up, drones. So again, you can do the uh, randomized game, so you can make it a lot more interesting. And then after that, you've got additional equipment cards. So in the additional equipment cards, let's see what we've got in here. Because, uh, yeah, like I said, there are additional equipment cards that come with for all the characters on here. So Abby's microphone, ammo band, blue figurines, cigarettes, clarinets, dug grenades, Gold medallions, holsters, Horton special booze, Jess's power suit, pin boards, red figures, scopes, Soph's power suit, sweets, toolbox, war paint, watches. Because you have the uh, two uh, girls that came out of Wolfenstein Youngblood, the last version. So you've got, um, I think it's. Uh, I think it's these two. No, I'm sorry. These two. So you've got BJ's twin daughters that you can play with. And they have additional cards, so that way you can run around with them if you really want to play Youngblood. So they kind of expanded on the Wolfenstein um, brand as much as they possibly could. And then, like I said, with uh, Hans Gross, he comes in a special card sleeve, so they already give you a sleeve for him, which is kind of nice. So we're going to put the trailer back on that. And then take a look at the books. Watch, these are cut out already, so that way you can't put them in wrong, like I was trying to do. So then you've got, again, the sleeved hero cards that come with the game. So you get all the extra characters if you really want them. And the game has set up in the, in the rules in such a nice way so that way you can interchange characters. So if you want to try it differently, you want to do the same missions, but you want to do with different characters, with different abilities, they make it so that way um, it's a challenge each time. And you can... Oops, I just lost one. You can uh, kind of do it however you want, which I think is a nice touch because they want you to have versatility so you can come back and play your game over and over again. Ooh, this is just breaking down on me. So, let's 
take a look and see what we've got in here. We've got Sigrun Engel, uh, Zofia Blaskowitz, you've got uh, Jacques Leroy, the clarinet player, uh, Horton Boone. And let's see here. After that, oh, they're just falling all over the place. Mary Sue Englinton, uh, Jesse Blaskowitz, Norman Cadwell. Tropes Wyatt the Third, and then you have the top sheet, which you've got a new updated B.J. Blaskowitz, Caroline Becker, Fergus Reed, and Grace Walker. Again, all these characters come out of Wolfenstein: New Order. Uh, a couple of them come out of New Colossus, and then you have the daughters that came out of uh, Wolfenstein: Youngblood. So after that, you have the new updated mission book. So it allows you to do missions on everything else. So it gives you the updated rules. So you can go back into the Wolfenstein 3D battles. Uh, you can go into Liberate Camp Belka, which is out of Wolfenstein New Order. Uh, Deathhead Compound, again, you can do that. Professor Bellevue's Barrier. So you can pull all this stuff out of Wolfenstein New Order. And then you have the Random Map Generator, which walks you through how to build a random map using all the additional room cards, so that way you can have your own randomized uh, battles, which are kind of neat. So they want to give you more versatility when going through this particular game. So that is the Wolfenstein All-Stars expansion. Again, it has a lot of versatility to it. So stay tuned as I continue my unboxing of the rest of the Wolfenstein uh, board game Kickstarter with the new boxes that I received from Archon Studios. Uh, so everyone, have a great gaming day.